What is going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of the ER Forum. So in today's video, we're gonna discuss whether or not I'm nervous or not nervous to start PA school. Welcome to the episode. Three, Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. So today is Sunday, May 31st. I'm uploading this video, well, I'm recording this video, I'm editing this video, and I will be uploading this video all today. Um, today is Sunday, so a lot of my family is here uh, cooking a lot of food, so you'll probably hear them uh, screaming in the background. But uh, once again, I'm making videos that you guys wanna see, so I'm answering a lot of you guys' questions. And the question that I chose for today, I think it's, um, it's a very interesting question and it's because I haven't really done too much thinking about it. So when I read the question, uh, whether or not I'm nervous to start PA school, I really had to think about it. And um, once I figured out some of my answers, I decided to go ahead and push record. So let's answer that question. Am I nervous to start PA school? I am absolutely nervous to start PA school. I am terrified. Um, but at the same time, I'm very excited. Again, as you, a lot of you guys know that this has been something I've been planning for a very long time, and so I'm very excited to, to you know, begin this journey and um, see where it takes me in terms of you know, the struggles I'm gonna be going through, the people that I'm gonna be meeting, the things that I'm gonna be learning, uh, but at the same time, I'm very nervous. I'm nervous because I've been out of school for quite a while. I did take some prerequisite courses um, once I actually graduated college and I was working as a nurse, but it was only one class at a given time. I mean, I'm going to go into a program that is gonna have an influx of credits. I think the first semester it has 24 credits. It's like six or seven courses. Um, so I'm going from not doing anything and just getting jammed with schoolwork. And so I'm a little nervous about that. I'm apprehensive about how I'm going to be able to handle that stress, how I'm gonna be able to make that transition successfully and be able to not only um, do well on these exams that I'll be taking in PA school, but actually comprehend the information and retain it for when I need to on my board exams, subsequently after PA school, and then obviously in my practice in practicing medicine after PA school. And so that's one thing that I'm very nervous about, the transition from not actually having any schoolwork to do. I've just been hanging out, relaxing, making YouTube videos, enjoying my time, it's sort of freedom, and then I'm gonna be entering into a very rigorous program, right? And so that's something that I'm very nervous about, but at the same time, in the back of my mind, I'm very excited because this has been something I've been waiting for for a very long time. And so the other thing that I realized that I'm very nervous about is being away from family, being away from friends. Um, you know, my whole life is here in Las Vegas. I know I'm gonna get through it. It's two years, it's really not that big of a deal. I know I'm gonna get through it. I know how I am. That doesn't necessarily take away the fact though that I'm not nervous to go. I'm very nervous to go. I know I'm gonna be lonely. I'm gonna be living on my own. I'm used to living with my parents, you know, my siblings, my brother, my sister, my sister's family. You know, there's always been a lot of people in the house uh, throughout high school and throughout college. So I've always had a lot of people there. And so to be on my own, um, away from everybody, it's gonna be really different. And so that's one of the things that I'm very nervous about, which is being isolated, being on my own and having to uh, make new friends, make new experiences, get familiar with the town, what restaurants do I like, what restaurants don't I like, where am I gonna go shopping, where am I gonna go spend my free time, what climbing gym, rock climbing gym am I gonna be picking to go to because I'm already comfortable at this one here in Las Vegas. And so it's just gonna be something that's new and that makes me a little nervous. Uh, the last thing that I thought about that uh, supports the reasons as to why I'm nervous to go to PA school is I'm gonna be losing an income, which we talked about this. You know, I've done my due diligence in saving on money, and you know, that'll be a whole nother video. I'll talk to you guys about, you know, how much I saved and how I went about figuring out how I'm going to finance PA school. Right now, I have a dependable income, an income that's coming in every two weeks, and it's something I'm not gonna have in PA school. And so if an emergency happens now, I'm not too worried about it because I've done a good job with saving money and I have emergency funds and I also have an active income coming in and so I'm not too worried about it but I'm gonna be vulnerable for two years. I'm not gonna have the health insurance that I have now. I'm not gonna have um, a very good income like I do now and so the unknown is nerve-wracking and it makes me very nervous to be somewhere for two years 
and not have an income depending solely on a savings account and the other forms in which I'm able to finance for PA school. It's just, uh, it's a dark unknown area and it makes me very nervous. And so those are the three things guys that I really thought about uh, when I was reading this question, whether or not I'm nervous to go to PA school. And so, yes, I am very nervous to go to PA school, you know, and there's always that sense of doubt in your mind. Um, obviously, I'm a very competent individual. I think I'm very intelligent. With that being said, there's always this um, complex where you don't think you're going to be good enough, where you're always wondering, what if, you know, I could fail this exam, I could get halfway through PA school, not pass boards, or get kicked out in some way, and where do I go from there? Luckily, I have a really good job to fall back on, but I'm still investing a lot of time. A lot of money has been spent already on this endeavor of mine and it's just very nerve wracking. And so, yes guys, I am very nervous to start PA school. That does not mean that I am not excited. I am so stoked to be able to start this journey and enjoy the journey and at the same time excited to finish the journey. And so it's, it's a lot of mixed emotions going through my mind in regards to PA school, but I'm happy to share that with you guys. I thought this was a very good question. And hopefully for some of you guys that are applying to PA school or applying to any program, uh, medical school, dental school, nursing school, that you really want to be in, you watch this video and realize it's okay to be excited and nervous at the same time. So really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, follow me on Instagram if you want to see what I am doing on a day-to-day -day basis. So really hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one.